Hi there, I'm Dr. Albert Chung and I'm your friendly proctologist. Thank you so much for being here. I'm so encouraged by the fact that you guys are commenting, you guys are engaging and trying to give each other some advice and giving each other some support. I really, really love seeing that from the, uh, uh, from the internet community, which is all around the world. Super awesome. And just remember, if you haven't already, please join the community by subscribing to the channel and liking the videos. I'm also here available to all of you. Um, there are video consultations to do with anyone in, in the world. There is a fee for the service, but email me at yourfriendlyproctologist at gmail.com to get all the details. Today, I want to talk to you about a very common question that I get, and the question makes complete sense. I mean, you won't believe how many people have thought of the question. And the question is, Dr. Chung, can hemorrhoids block my poop? I'm sitting there on the toilet and it feels like something is really shutting the door on me. And of course I see these hemorrhoids coming out or I know that hemorrhoids live in there. Gosh, and it feels so tight. I have to strain so hard. It's gotta be, it's gotta be my hemorrhoids. And I certainly understand that that is a very logical question. So the answer to that question is simply no, no they do not. And you're thinking to Dr. Chung, how are you so sure? Because if you have large hemorrhoids and they're popping in and out of you, then you can certainly believe that, hey, these things have size, these things can definitely block the inside of my anus. I mean, they're coming out from the inside, why wouldn't they? And I'll tell you that there are actually people who do not have big hemorrhoids, they're very small, and they still feel the same symptoms as someone with bigger hemorrhoids. They still feel like there's a trap door that's locked locked tight and they've got to push and strain in order to get poop out and those people the hemorrhoids are not blocking them either so what is blocking your your poop from coming out is actually your anal sphincter muscles your internal sphincter muscle and your in your external sphincter muscle right those are the muscles that are circular and are opening and closing so let me show you a handy dandy model here's a debut of something i got which is like the most accurate model i've ever seen let's get to that okay so here we have the model of the rectum which is this long part here the intestine and then you have the anus down below right and with this model, the hemorrhoids are where these blue dots are, and they're lining the inside of her anus here. The muscles, this light pink stuff here, this is the anal sphincter muscles that are opening and closing. And I'll tell you, these hemorrhoids, while they are flat in this drawing, even if they're bigger, the hemorrhoids are actually soft enough to push out of the way. When the poop is coming from this direction, it will travel through whether there are hemorrhoids or not. The hemorrhoids are just spongy pieces of blood vessels fill the blood and they just if they're going to get in the way they're just going to pop out of here but i'll tell you these muscles are very strong and all they need to do is just squeeze on you in order for you to feel like nothing is coming out so when you poop what is actually happening is your anus muscles are struggling to open up or in other words they're struggling to relax to open that hole Instead, they're, what they're doing is clamping down and tightening down. So what you have to do is actually push harder, wait longer in order for the poop to stretch out that hole and then the poop will come out of the anus, okay? The hemorrhoids, as big as they may be, I'm telling you again, they're spongy, they're soft, and they move back and forth and they do not create a blockage situation. It's the anal muscles that are super duper strong in your bottom end. And that is what's creating the blockage situation. So what do I recommend in that situation? I highly recommend that you see a pelvic floor physical therapist. Most often, this is a issue where your muscles need to be retrained, reconditioned, taught how to relax, and for you to get control of your internal and external sphincter muscles. I also believe that seeing a specialist is also in your best interest 
Make sure there's no other issues going on there that is causing you to feel like a blockage is there at your anus because there's a list about a mile long about what could be going in there. But what's most common probably if you've got hemorrhoid issues is that you probably have anal spasm going on and your muscles are just way too tight and they're causing you to work harder than you need to. So I hope this video was helpful for you, at least prompt you to have some questions to ask your doctor and give you some frame of reference that yes, it is, it is, excuse me, no, it is not your hemorrhoids that are blocking you, it's your anus that's most, com most likely to be blocking your poop when you go number two. Thank you so much, take care, bye-bye.